Hello everyone, this is a video tutorial on signing up for Gmail. This is part one to using Google's email service. So first we begin by opening up the web browser and we go to www.google.com. Next you're going to click on Gmail and then you're going to click on create an account. So now we begin by filling in our information I'm going to do my first and last name. And for the desired login name, this is going to be your email address. So you're going to pick something that's going to be unique but easy to remember. So I'll try my first and last name. And I'm also going to add four digits. And then I'm going to check availability and it's available. So then what I'm gonna do is choose a password and it has to be a minimum of eight characters. Okay and the next two options is stay signed in or enabled web history and if I'm on a public computer I'm gonna uncheck this because I don't want to remain signed in and enabling web history just basically remembers uh, some of the information that you input or search so that it makes it easier the next time you want to search something. So for a security question, I'm going to write my own question and I'll ask, who are you? And my answer is going to be, so next is the recovery email and this is an email address that you want to uh, provide in case you forget your password so it can email uh, the information to an alternate email address okay next I'm gonna put in the birth date and now I have to do a word verification these words here it's jumbled up for a reason and it's to ensure that you are actually a person and not another computer signing up for a bunch of email accounts so try to type it in the best you can if it's not right then uh, it's okay just try it again and then once you're done with that click on I accept and create my account okay so that's it we have now signed up for a gmail account and we can begin by using gmail services click on show me my account and it will take you to your inbox the next video you're gonna watch you're gonna learn how to check your emails archive your emails and also add contacts to your contacts list